So comprehensive planning is something that's required by the state of Texas. So while the comprehensive plan for Dallas doesn't have any legal force in the sense that it changes zoning and what you're allowed to do with the land, it does set the tone and plans out what the imagined future use is for our city. So it's designed not only to recognize what's in place today, but set the expectations as to what is going to happen in the future as we plan for what, where the city is going to go over the next 10 to 20 years. So I'm sorry, you said it is required by the state of Texas, right, to have a comprehensive land use plan. This is true. Okay. Whether or not the city does anything with it at all is something else entirely. In fact, if you look in the city code, you will see a very short blurb in the uh, city code in re relation to zoning. And it says basically that the comprehensive plan is an advisory vision setting document and is not set zoning. And in my estimation, City Plan Commission has more or less ignored it since the last one passed. Um, it has mostly only been referenced by staff during staff reporting.